Um, next point then, we've looked at that. It was the response in terms of Barcelona, Sierra Leone, um, Charlottesville. Oh, yeah. I just wanted to deal with some of that because even just as now you've just told me that blue lives matter, is that I'm sure it must be a pink lives matter. <laughs> so. However, God. it's like you're having to say black lives matter because it's evident the way that stuff is reported in the mm -hmm. mainstream media. Mm -hmm. It's evident that black lives don't matter the same. I, I remember telling people that I was doing a, a media course at a university some years back and they had a thing called news values. Yeah. And they go through the value of news mm -hmm. and if it's western and white, it gets a one. Mm -hmm. If it's third world and black, it gets a five and things are graded along that, that thing. So we've had a situation recently, a tragedy where um, through a mudslide that took place in Sierra Leone, there were, I think it's over 400. 450 people. confirmed dead. 600 so, When I first saw it, it was 300, but I believe it's gone up to yeah. 460, you say to. 450 confirmed. 450 confirmed. And they're actually expecting it to rise more. About 12,000. Okay. So this has taken place in this week. And you might not really know about this if it wasn't for WhatsApp and Facebook. Mm -hmm. You might not hear. So those lives are not important to our news media or. You see that, I mean, it's holiday time, but if you were in school, those lives are not something we're going to tell the other children, you know, hold on, wait. Minute silence. We need a minute no. silence for the four. No. Like, you don't need nothing. No. But then if there's, if, you know, 13 white lives, we need a minute silence. We need to every front page of every newspaper because this is News Valley 1 right now. Mm -hmm. And it's like understanding that, mm -hmm. then it's important not for us to change them. I'm not fussy. If they do what they do. But we have to have some news values, and, and maybe because of where our people are, it'd take us some time to shift there. But we've got to have some news values where that becomes number one. That's why, obviously, for us, the main issue, or our first issue in the day, is the passing of Brother Dick Gregory, because that may not be nothing to them, but that's one of our giants, that's one of our soldiers. Mm -hmm. So we salute him before we get on with the show, do you know what I mean? If we look at Sierra Leone, it's just the fact that those lives, you know what I mean, it's, they're, they're talking about a thousand people. And I think Brother David was talking about the actual cause of it, which I'll let you, you, you get into. But it's just like those lives are not, they're not seen as important what enough. You, because I know if I was in school right now and this had taken place, there we wouldn't be talking, no one in the staff room was talking about it. But I know there was a few things that happened this year here. And it was, you make sure, like, make sure there's two minutes of silence at this time. Bell goes off, everyone is silent. See, it's serious if you violate that. Because you're in their system mm. and in their system they need you to respect love mm. honor them yeah and the liberals that you're speaking of or that we've been speaking of would like us to stay like that because it works for them mm. but unless we have unless we get to a point where um like you know mr donald is saying like you can get lost i don't really care for you and we want to do something for ourselves if we had a school of our own then we can take time and have a discussion we can talk about the, the tragedy, but we can also talk, and maybe David, you might want to expand on this, but we can maybe talk about deforestation. Mm. Because apparently this is caused by, um, the mudslide is caused by deforestation. Mm. But deforestation means somebody's making money out of timber. Mm. And if you think about Sierra Leone, we're not talking about somewhere that's waxing rich off the income of timber. Mm. David? In the news, uh, I don't know what, <coughs> What station or what source was the news highlighting the Syrian Iran situation? But it's not reported. If it was by BBC, by BBC, it wasn't for our benefit. Mm. Other than to add to the fact that black life doesn't matter, it was to make a point to those in industry. Because I said Bush, um, Trump is a trader. Mm. So mudslide traders hear that. They know what they're hearing. Someone's trading over there, one of us are trading over there, they come to the wood, the tree, taking it out, and that's how you get that mudslide. That scientist looking at that mudslide and said, this didn't make no sense. This is not a natural occurrence, because they give that illusion that when these things happen, it's just, God, this naturally happens. It's like I was, I was hearing that verse, like, but I was hearing the word when they say when they have certain animals, they're talking about the elephant being, becoming extinct. Even the term extinct gives an illusion and an assumption that this happened naturally. Mm -hmm. No, it's actually you <laughs> causing your, yeah. your, it's a, it's a genocide, you know what I'm saying, mm. it's an action by you killing these things off. But 
it's extinction, just like it's just natural. Mm. Mm. That's so true. Yeah. So these people were with, could we talk with the history? That when, in our early days of them coming out the caves and they come amongst us and they cause trouble, we, re we, 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 we identified them running from amongst us, took everything, but they just kept the language. All they have is words. Mm. And we listen to them too much. So we just made a point about, about Trump and he made a point on a legend. But I'm a few months tired, you got Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> on a legend. <laughs> I'm sorry, viewers, but there's no such thing as Santa Claus. <laughs> but they made a whole world on it. Yeah. Yeah. And money and industry is based on mythology. Yeah. Mm. If you're not in it, you're crazy. Yeah. So he's mm. good at making something up that ain't and then getting us living in there. And, and even saying, you know, I don't really believe it because many of the listeners will be like, no, 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 I'm not really in it. Santa Claus is a fantasy. What are you getting me for Christmas? <laughs> like, no, no. My pocketbook is. Yeah, there you go. I'm putting a tree up for the children. <laughs> Ain't nobody interested in that. But you're even as, like, we've got to get to a point where it's like it just don't exist. It yeah. don't exist. So going back to that point in terms of the um, mudslide. The mudslide. Yeah. When you take out a tree, or trees, because trees hold the soil together, yeah, anchor it. Mm. Yeah. and also the roots absorb the water. Mm. So when water comes, the tree does its part in dealing with it. Mm. When you take out the trees, you take out the, the 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 element that holds the mud and absorbs the water. Mm. So when you have a mudslide, and then they talk about mudslide, but they're not talking about the cause of something. It's that big bang thing, suddenly mm. a bang, big bang. But so if I get this right from what you're saying, mm -hmm. like, and it's just to get the understanding, it's like I have my village, mm -hmm. my village is here, mm -hmm. above my village is a ridge, mm -hmm. it's filled with trees. Mm -hmm. Someone comes, cuts down all the trees that protect my village, and then go, oh no, there's a much larger all See, there. And this is the thing, I, I read, I read on, on the same story actually, two weeks before, um, their environmental protection agency, in the, the environmental protection agency in that country went there two weeks before, and they'd identified it as a risk and they'd apparently tried to plant trees there but it was unsuccessful. So that's what I mean, it just tells you that. Two weeks before there's two a... Two weeks before it took place. But the same happened over here a couple of years ago where the floods uh -huh. up in the Midlands and they were saying we have to plant the seeds in the bushes. They took out the bushes, they knew that because it holds the flood water but for commercial reasons they got rid of it and that's why we had the floods and stuff. So they know this. It's that mindset. It's they just know. profit above people. So oh, isn't it? that's it. And yeah. so the point of the mudslide, they, but they would just say mudslide and not say the cause of it. Mm -hmm. We wanted the money. The, the <laughs> trees hold the earth. The trees, and the analogy of that to me, when I see the society, the tree represents the family structure. When you rip out the family structure, then you wonder why you're getting gang violence and the dis disorder amongst our young people. Because the very foundation has been taken out of the community. Mm -hmm. So you're getting a mudslide of destruction in that community. But they'll just say, look at the youth, the violence, who the violence. But you know, what the cause of it? The undermining of the family structure mm -hmm. that we're a part of letting them undermine it. Yes. And they wonder yes. why we're getting a mudslide in our own community. Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's deep. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Here's our brother David. Mm -hmm.